If you were watching this, then I am dead. Oh, you just Gordon helping me work out the computer. Golden? Golden? Are you sure it's recording? Yes, Ron! Alright. Hmm. If you were watching this, then I am already gone. And there are a few bits and bobs I would like sorted out. Firstly, I would like Tom Jones to sing at my funeral. I ever so like him. If he's not available, then, you know, get just one of those cheap knockoffs. Like the Ralph Gates or the Bubble Fella. Buble Grand. It's Michael Buble. Yes, yes, Mickey Buble. Secondly, and most importantly, I would like this played at the Paris Council meeting so I could tell everyone just how thankful I am for everything you have done for Gingham and how happy I am that I don't have to put up with your bullshit anymore! <laughs> Merry Christmas, you filthy animals! Ah, hello and welcome. Merry Christmas. First and foremost, I have to say how lovely it was to see you all from a safe distance, of course, at Maggie's funeral. Margaret loved us, and especially this council. She was a great friend and role model to us all. Which is a darn, darn shame. A darn shame. Right, right, well, uh, as we look to the Christmas period of relaxed restrictions, we must all remain vigilant and do what we can to keep everyone safe. And with that in mind, there will only be two wise men on the nativity display to keep to the rule of six. What? Absolutely not. You can't get rid of one of the wise men. It'll look stupid. Who would you prefer, Brian? Get rid of the baby. It's small. It won't affect the overall aesthetic that way. You want us to get rid of the baby Jesus from the nativity? What, so it's just a gathering in a stable with far too few girls? Women! You know I meant women. Right, right. But what about the presents? You need free presents from free wise men. Um, uh, um, yes, yes, we have thought of this. Um, Norman, Norman, uh, would you care to explain? Ah, yes. Uh, so to encourage appropriate behaviour during this Christmas season, we've decided that we should make the gifts more Covid friendly. Uh, so the first wise man, he's going to be giving antibacterial hand gel. And then the second wise man, he's going to be giving a face mask. And we don't have a third wise man, so the shepherd is going to come on and give Joseph his furlough money from the workshop. Ah, uh, but what about Angel Gabriel? Ah, uh, yes, yes. Unfortunately, the angel was hired separately. Freelance, you see. So... The Angel Gabriel display has had to find work in the Amazon warehouse this year. Our uh, Harold, Norma sent her best. She said she'll be round later to pick up the presents for her mother. Presents? Yes, for Norma's mum. Apparently you said you had something good lined up for her. Ah, yes, of course. Are we sure she's going to make it till then? What, this afternoon? <laughs> I think she'll be fine. Bugger. Oh, Trev, you've been quiet. What's wrong, you big flip-flop? Boris has just announced... No more relaxed restrictions. Uh, sorry, Trevor? Boris has cancelled Christmas! Uh, uh, calm, calm down, calm down. I'm, I'm sure they're just being uh, uh, overcautious, thinking ahead. Yes, yes, excellent stuff. Well done. You see, Christmas is just a day. 
it's time to spend with your family from a safe distance. It is a day to celebrate the birth of our Lord with your loved ones, with your friends and with your family, just completely separately and from really far away. Yes, excellent stuff from Boris there. <laughs> it, it, it's not like coronavirus could get any worse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, imagine COVID got better at being a virus. <laughs> yes, yes, like it's been uh, practising all this time. And now it's got its running shoes on and can transfer from person to person quicker. <laughs> yes, yes, and then and then the world will start cutting us off so they can stay safe from the super COVID. <laughs> can you imagine? <laughs> 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 oh goodness. Ah, oh, lovely. Oh, for fuck. Just see a ghost, a bell, jingle, and ring.